want a lot for Christmas There is just one thing I need I don't care about the presents Underneath the Christmas tree I just want you for my own More than you could ever know Make my wish come true all I want for Christmas is you. How's it going folks, this is Wayne all back for another lesson and yes it's that time of year again, the horrible Christmas jumpers are out uh, but a classic Christmas song today, Mariah Carey and All I Want For Christmas Is You um, Fantastic song, Christmas isn't the same without this one this is one that I hadn't covered before so uh, I thought I'd do a tutorial on this one it's reasonably easy to play, there is one bar chord in it um, so, but I always say you know, it's a good one for beginners to sort of take on bar chords so without further ado let's get to it okay so this song is in standard tuning and the first verse is done with sort of single strum so verse one we're going to use a g chord i personally use the four fingered g so i don't want a lot for christmas there is one thing that i need we go to a c I don't care about the presents And this is going to be the bar chord that we're going to need It's an E flat So that's played up on the, you know, on barring You know, the top five strings That's on the sixth fret And I'm picking out sort of an A chord You know, that would be on the eighth fret, okay? So it gives us an E flat Underneath the Christmas tree Then we go into the chorus part, so a G I'd want you to fill my up B7 We go to an E minor More than you could You got the E flat again Ever know We go back to the G Make my wish come true Now this is where we want an E7 So there's different ways that you can play an E7 But the E7 that I use If you did an E major All you do is take the third finger off And a lovely E7 sounding chord And then we go to an A minor all I want for a D7 Christmas is And this is where we start strumming So we got a G E7 A minor And a D7 again Okay, so I'll quickly just go through that Obviously the single strums on You can see how the words are going to fit around that So we've got the G chord first of all I don't want a lot for Christmas there is one thing that I need See, I don't care about the press E flat Underneath the Christmas tree To a G I want you a four B7 my own E minor More than you could E flat again Ever know G Make my wish come E7 True There we go A minor all I want for D7 Christmas It's where we start strumming Is G E7 A minor D7 Okay, we go through the verse again G, so I don't want a lot for Christmas There is one thing that I need C I don't care about the B flat Underneath 
Christmas tree She had pizza and my stocking There upon the fireplace See, Santa Claus will make me happy He flat underneath the Christmas tree got the chorus, did she? I want you for my own Oh, you could ever know Make my wish come true All I want for D7 is you Got that little link again, E7, A minor D7, and that pretty much goes around again, okay? So the only other different part in the song, other than sort of the outro, is this little middle part where we go to a B7. So we got a B7. All the lights are shining to an E minor, brightly everywhere. B7 again. And the sound of children's E minor, laughter fills the air. We got that E flat again. Everyone is singing. To an E minor, sleigh bells ringing. Hey, is that the only thing we would really need? Oh, bring my baby to me. I don't want it. And we go back into the verse again. Okay, so very quickly with that. So we want a B7. And the lights are shining. So E minor, so brightly everywhere. Again, B. And the sound of children's to an E minor. Laugh. Yeah, E flat. Okay, we got the singing a G to an E minor. A. And then we go with D. Okay, so then there's another verse, another chorus, and the only difference is the outro sort of keeps going around until the song fades. So that basically is just the G. E minor. A minor to a normal D, D major. All I want for Christmas is you, baby. Round again. Okay, so that just pretty much leaves us with a strumming pattern. Um, like I say, the intro was done with single strums, but when we start strumming, you know, I sort of improvise a little bit, but a good sort of pattern, you know, a good foundation for the song will be down, down, up, up, down, up. So we'd have a... So down, down, up, up, down, up. So down, down, up, up, down. And that is pretty much all you're going to need. Okay, so thanks very much for watching. Hope you all dug that. Uh, I do apologise for me singing. I'm not Mariah Carey and I, I probably never will be. So it is sort of sung in a baritone way. Uh, but please forgive me for that. I hope I did it justice. Uh, but, you know, it's, it's that time of year now. It's great to play Christmas songs. I personally love Christmas songs, even the cheesy ones. And uh, I have covered quite a lot of Christmas songs. So if you want to go over on my playlist, um, a lot of the obvious ones are there. If you want to learn them for Christmas, you know, now is the time. Uh, but uh, like I say, I hope you all dug that. Thanks very much for watching. And if you've got any requests for any other Christmas songs maybe that I haven't done, you can either comment in the post below or a good way to reach me on social media if you like my page on Facebook, which is Wayne R Guitar. I'm also under the same name on Twitter if you want to give me a follow on there. And you can send me a personal message or, you know, not just Christmas songs, maybe songs probably going into next year now, 50s to modern day, anything within reason that works well on an acoustic guitar, you know, just send me a message. And I do always reply to messages. Uh, and at this point, I'd just like to thank everyone for your continued support, you know, all the subscribers, all the messages. It really does mean a lot. And I'd just like to wish you all a great Christmas and a really healthy New Year, okay? Um, like I say, it really has been heartfelt this year, all, all your messages and support and the continued subscribers and people who, uh, you know, love watching my tutorials because it's sort of, I hope, you know, I aim to sort of make it down to earth and sort of accessible and easy for people to understand and 
I think the majority of comments I get are really positive and I think I'm doing my job. So uh, like I say, thanks for the continued support and I'd just like to wish everybody a great Christmas and a really healthy New Year. So I will catch you for a lesson very soon. Take care.